Hi EC Church friends, it's Jim Merman at Evangelical Seminary. First I want to say, hoping you're having a happy Advent and an upcoming Merry Christmas. I want to speak to a survey that was done in 2012 by Tom Rainer, one of the leadership church leadership gurus. And in it he listed the seven regrets of a pastor. Here's what they are. Number one, feeling like there was a lack of practical training for local church ministry. Number two, overly concerned about critics' opinions in their church. Three, failure to exercise faith. At some point, the pastor felt like they started to play defense in their ministry. Four, not enough time for family. Five, failure to understand basic business and finance issues within their church. Six, failure to share ministry, how difficult volunteer management is and as delegation. And number seven, failure to make deep friendships. Well, I think uh, that stuff's right on. And I don't know if it's true for your experience, but I hang out with a lot of pastors, help pastor a church myself. These are some of the challenges we face. I think seminary education has something to say to those things. It's no small matter that number one had to do with people graduating from seminary and feeling like they didn't receive the kind of training. Matter of fact, this survey said that people believe that 80% of what they faced in their churches actually was not addressed in their seminary training. That's got to change, and we've been changing it here at Evangelical, and we've recently announced a partnership with Sioux Falls Seminary that's going to be taking us back to a much more mentor-based approach to students who are coming through this institution so that holistic education around the entire ministry experience is taking place. Exciting things are going on. You've heard some of the stats. Maybe you have, maybe you haven't. We've had one of our biggest years ever, both in finances we had come in last year and student enrollment. Those are all exciting things, but the real excitement lies in the fact that I'm hoping 10 years from now, this list of seven regrets is different. <laughs> I want the regrets to be around whether or not we stepped out enough, whether or not we believed for the expansion of the kingdom enough, whether or not we truth talked enough. Those are the kind of regrets, not whether or not we felt prepared for the work we're doing. So I'm asking you at the end of this year, to keep in, keep in touch with Evangelical Seminary. Know a little bit about what we're up to because we're trying to serve you and the people that are coming up in your ministry ranks. So if it comes to end of your giving at your church, if you have anything extra you can kick in to help make our mission happen, whether your budget has a little bit extra, whether your missions budget has something in that we can put toward international scholarship of even ECers from around the world, we'd love to hear from you now. And most importantly, we're with you in ministry, and we want to wish you a really Merry Christmas.